Well, there's a sense of relief out here. I mean, you think about this. This is a 17-year-old thought to be the killer. Uh, he was on the loose, considered to be armed and dangerous. All that stress on top of losing two people who were very well known in this area. At the Front Street Cafe in New Richmond, the newest item in the window isn't the latest special. We are actually going to host a benefit here on Saturday, July 30th. It's a notice about two people who were special to the area. Kayla Lacey is the general manager here. They've both just been a, a member of our community, you know, forever. Um, New Richmond's a very close-knit community. Ryan Larrison, 34, and his father, 59-year-old Rusty Larrison, were the victims of a brutal murder, shot to death at their home just a few miles from the Front Street Cafe, where Rusty once worked and was known to about everyone around. It's devastating, yeah. We can't imagine how their family's feeling, and we just, we want to take any burden we can off of them. As family and friends remember the victims. State of Ohio versus Dakota Pfeiffer. Investigators have been busy making arrests. Dakota Pfeiffer was in court, now charged with murder. He's held on a $1.5 million bond, even though he is not thought to have pulled the trigger. 18-year-old Anthony Montgomery is also charged with murder, and now his 17-year-old brother is among the latest arrest, a juvenile we're not showing, he's believed to be the shooter. In total, six people, including four juveniles, are under arrest in connection with the deaths. And while they face charges, those who knew the victims face another kind of reality, and now pulling together to get through it. You get to know everyone in Richmond here. Everyone comes in. It's very, like I said, very close knit community. Yeah, investigators believe the motive for this robbery. Meanwhile, the folks here at Front Street Cafe are getting ready for that fundraiser. Again, that's July 30th. Reporting live, Brian Hamrick, WLWT News 5.